Breaking Breaking, your favorite presidential candidate, did what? Now let's get to it. Well, I don't keep up with the days and time no more, ho. I just chase a bag. I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing, man. What the f am I supposed to talk about on screen about politics, bro? It's a long week, bro. It's a long week, bro. It's a lot of shit going on, bro. Okay? I'm over here petting out. Hey, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel, The Mix. Like this video, share this video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Drop some comments in the chat. Keep it respectful. Share, share, share. Like, like, like. It is free to like. It is free to share. And most importantly, it is free to subscribe. Thank you guys for your continued support, those domestically and internationally. For those new to my channel, I pre-record most of my videos. I typically go live on the weekend. I also conduct giveaways, you guys. Yes, via comment picker cash giveaway. So stay tuned. Stay connected to The Mix. That is my way of giving back to the community the online community those who are subscribers those who are viewers commenters i do run away the summit picker so stay connected but as you can see what this video is going to be about yes before i do that go ahead and hit that cash app the sale payment information is in the description section of this post you can also hit that thanks all donations you guys yes. go towards content enhancement creation and helps creators like me myself evolve yes so go ahead and drop some cash apps go ahead and drop some thanks hit that thanks one dollar two dollar three dollars whatever donations help my channel so thank you guys in advance for your support as you find yeah multi-millionaire streamers <laughs> don't tell me politics is getting into the streaming world you know what i don't know this might be a wave this might be a motion as the young folks say i don't know hopefully it doesn't decide the outcome of the um, election so for those who do not know popular streamer and i did uh, a video on this uh, popular streamer aiden ross let me pause right here aiden ross is the, the jewish kid 23 years old young kai Sinet, i think 23 years old too they are multi-millionaires <laughs> <Streamer. laughs> i mean kai Sinet, uh, streamer between two youtube channels that i'm aware of one channel has 9.5 million subscribers and his other youtube channel has over 6 million subs so but they're not just on a youtube space these fellas are on kick are on twitch are on ig are on uh, x so the uh, combination of all the platforms they have probably uh, probably over 30 to 40 million you know followers and subscribers if you total that up for each one of them possibly you know so but the thing is is that they're young they stream video game they entertain do pranks and all that how i know all of this you guys how how do i know all of this because i have young kids that keep me in a loop. yes i have young kids that keep me in a loop and also i create content so as you all are aware aiden did or some of you all might be aware aiden did a stream with former president trump but former president trump's son baron is a fan of aiden is and baron is young too around what 19 20 so they're all in the same you know demographic community wise so when it comes to the online streaming and these fellas be streaming for hours 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 even dj academic is in the mix as well too google these people so but it's being reported according to kai sanat yes u.s secret service and vp kamala harris begging top streamer kai sanat to do a stream with him yeah so they reached out to kai on the flip side aiden reached out to former president trump so but aiden is into trump aiden is a trump supporter aiden if you guys follow these kids you'll know what they're kind of into etc etc and this is their life they like streaming and all streamers have they their niche some of them switch it up some of them start to do interviews and all of that too so excuse the background noise you guys um uh, but yeah so uh let's hear what kai sanat had to say <laughs> about the u.s secret service and vp kamala reaching out to him begging it was trending too you guys this was trending all on x yesterday too they was it was funny the jokes uh write itself but yeah so let's hear what kai had to say because he is in a u-haul I, I don't have time to explain why kai sanat is in a u-haul don't get it twisted he can afford a multi-million dollar home <laughs> this kid has i think he's worth over 20 million as well so and that's kai and aiden i think is probably worth around the same or even more so and they do a lot of collaborations in terms of brand deals and this and that so they get money Money in this digital space when it comes to streaming and that's all they do these kids stream 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 so why not get paid to do what you like to do you know i always say it's great when you love what you're doing so let's go ahead and take a listen to what else kai sanat had to say new york then on top of that i got the fucking secret service calling me
politics, bro. Oh, okay. Chat, listen to me. No shade. No nothing. Okay. It's a long week, bro. It's a long week, bro. It's a long week, bro. It's a lot of shit going on, bro. So my thought was, okay, let me go. This whole shit happened, right? Let me go give y'all Bloodborne. 30 hours. I know a lot of people did not like it because of the, um, me not being paid DLC. But, bro, it's a very hard time right now, dude. Now, let me go ahead and say something. All in a matter of a week, I got the Secret Service. I got, hey, I'm going to keep it a stack. I'm going to go ahead and say it. I don't give a f Okay? Listen, I had a bad that I've been trying to get on for, like, the last three years, the last two years that I haven't, I haven't spoke to in, like, a year. I haven't spoke to this girl in so goddamn long who gonna have the audacity to text me. We need you a part of the campaign. At first I was talking, I was thinking she was talking about like a game, a video game, like a, a Modern Warfare game um, or some or if not that, a clothing brand. I'm like, what campaign? Sure you gonna say, ah! You're not gonna get into details. <laughs> Yo, this is why I can't do that. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it a second with y'all boys, okay? What the f is Kasanak gonna talk about with politics, man? <laughs> Let's be real. Hey, look, mark my words. I'm gonna say it right now. If this some way, somehow, something was to go into where I do the stream of politics, I'm going to be 100% honest. I'm going to sit on my stream and say, why did you guys call me? <laughs> you know, I don't know. I've never did anything, I've never did anything with politics. And I got, and these blogs are like, trying to say, yo, we gotta do this shit, God. <laughs> and it's all the top blogs. And I'm like, bro, since when did you care about what Kaz and that had to talk about for politics? You feel me? Chat, it's not even, it's not even a particular person. It's all sides of the field. All sides of the field. I don't know what's going on. I haven't even been in tune. Shout out to Aiden. I know Aiden is some shit, but that's, but Aiden's more into that, you know? Like, that's, it is more into that. Chat, when I tell you, I don't know what's going on. I don't, like, I don't know. You feel me? I, I only gonna do it if it makes sense. And I don't know it. I, don't, I apologize for people that wanna see it so bad. But that's just not my lane. You know, I can't force something that's not me. You feel me? I, I can't. And I just can't sit there and force something that's just not me. And that's, and that's okay. You feel me? And that's okay. If I open this U-Haul truck, and there's two black vans outside. You know. Okay. Nah, but chat, I'm not gonna lie though. Um, yeah, that's the reason. We're gonna stream today. We're gonna have a great stream today. But it's just a lot, bro. Like, I come to New York after Bloodborne, you that's not even in America. Okay, you guys. So what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? <laughs> the Secret Service and VP Kabbalah Hair is big in Casting to be a stream. There is a big difference, you guys. I'm telling you, there's a big difference between Kai and Aiden. Aiden reached out to Trump. Kamala Camp is reaching out to Kai. Aiden supports Trump. Aiden has spoke about Trump on his channel. Aiden is cool with Baron Trump. So this is a big difference. Aiden pursued Trump for the interview. Kai ain't pursuing nobody for no political interview. Kai is so into his streaming, his day-to-day -day fun stuff. Kai is a fun streamer, you guys. So, But what are your thoughts on his comments saying how they <laughs> call him about five times? And about the campaign, some chick, I guess, he really, really likes, excuse me, he thinking that she is going to, um, she, you know, she hitting him up for, you know, hey, what's up, boo thing? <laughs> what's up, boo thing? And it's not. <laughs> it's a farce. Because she wants him to join a Kamala campaign. He thinking uh, <laughs> clothing campaign, music-wise. <laughs> He ain't thinking politics. You see how his mind is, you guys? And it's funny because he's a kid to me. I got kids his age, their age. So it's funny. But I'm happy that Kai is not being fake about it. And Kai is known to be honest about music. And just follow him. Follow him if you have time or if you're interested. Stay in the loop, old people. <laughs> and I'm old, too. I'm of a lather age, too, for those who are tuning in. You gotta stay in the loop of what these young people are doing digital wise, technology wise. So, but these fellas, these young cats, even DJ Academics, they they they're making more money than celeb than, than your rap artists. I'm telling you, they are. They got more uh, net revenue than these rap artists. And these guys, the streamers, they ain't all flashy, flashy. They get them a beautiful home, might get one car, two car, and and take care of their family. They ain't wear, as you can see, they don't wear jewelry and all that stuff. They not, you know, don't get it twisted. They have that, just not what they do do. You know, if if that makes sense. So. 
I'm happy that Kai is not going to be fake. As you heard, like he said, he big up Aiden for taking that lane or that route. But like he said, Aiden is into that. Kai said he's not into that. Kai was like, I'm not into that. Not my lane. You know, I, basically he would be fake. He don't know what to say. He don't know. He, he Like Kai said, he don't even know what's going on in politics. <laughs> so he's not even in, tuned in or in the loop. So I can't do nothing but respect Kai. Why jump on a wave? Because... Your, your homie did it you know and Aiden like I said Aiden and Kai are close friends so but like Kai said that's Aiden's lane not my lane you know and if 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 he was to do that he gonna ask them why y'all calling me why what's what's the deal what, what you know so and Kai is known to be truthful when it comes to reviews when it comes to uh, music reviews and things of that nature so a lot of his streams are on that movies he just does he does skits he does pranks all of that excuse the u-haul but kai is doing some other stuff i think trying to trying to switch some things up so so they moved from the amp home i think in georgia and now they're he's back in new york so but yeah let me know your thoughts you guys down in the chat this has been trending on um x formerly known as twitter it's been going down yes kamala harris begging kai to do a stream i don't think it would go down i'm 99.9999 percent sure it won't go down the reason why i say that in my opinion kai and aiden are close friends a lot of those streamers they're close friends and to my understanding, Kai is likely that Kai supports um, former President Trump. To my understanding, you know, I could be wrong, but I, I trust me, you guys. I follow these kids, and you can kind of sense who's into what, you know. So, but yeah. So let me head on over to X, formerly known as Twitter, and then I'll come back with more. <laughs> okay, you guys. This is X, formerly known as Twitter. As you can see, Kai Sinet top trending. 31.5k posts trending in political figures and the reason why kai again is trending in political figures because the united states secret service and kamala harris vp kamala harris camp reaching out to kai sanat the top streamer top streamer on many different platforms their camp reaching out to kai to do a stream let's jump in a chat i'm in tears she really she really wasted no time this person said uh this person said kai sanat is getting calls from kamala harris and a secret service to do a stream with her after aiden's Aiden Ross in Donald Trump's stream broke the internet, but he said he doesn't want anything to do with her. <laughs> well, he didn't say that specifically. Let's just be clear. Those were not his words based off of the clip I went over. Those were not his words. In my opinion, he just basically said that I don't F with, I don't give a F. Like basically he don't give a F about none of that, the politics. He's more into this bloodline thing or whatever streaming type of thing he's been doing and trying to get settled with his streaming in New York. So Kai ain't even thinking about politics like that, in my opinion. This person says breaking streamer Kai Sinat says he's been getting calls from Kamala's campaign and the Secret Service to set up a live stream with Kamala, but he wants nothing to do with them. Kamala is getting rejected by everyone. I don't give a uck. And those were quotation marks. Those were uh, top streamer Kai Sinat's words, as you heard on that. Yeah. So what are your thoughts, you guys? What are your thoughts? Again, Kai is trending. A lot of blogs, vlogs, a lot of podcasters and probably streamers was telling him to do it, do it. Like I said in that video, he has it has to be to be into something like that. Basically, and I'm paraphrasing. He basically was saying he can't be fake with it. He can't be fake. It, it has to be a good feeling. It has to make sense for him, as he said. So, and I'm quoting and paraphrasing. Okay, this person says Kai Sinat says he's been getting calls from Kamala's Harris campaign and the Secret Service for a possible collab and stream with Kamala, and says he wants no parts of politics and isn't gonna involve himself. In the chat. Later on, he clarified if he was to do one, he'll be transparent as possible. Yeah, he said something like that, but he went on to say that he couldn't say his, he see himself doing that. This person says, that's right, Kai, stand on biz. Don't get Kamala is Trump 2024. Again, these are comments on X, formerly known as Twitter. In the chat, these are comments, their opinion. This person says, smart of Kai to decline. Aiden sought out Trump. Kamala's just trying to use Kai to pander votes. She's literally done zero as VP, and this will just divide his diverse fan base. And let me just piggyback off of that. Um, I this comment i'm sort of rocking with i think if kai was to entertain it he probably would see a decline in his, in his um stream streaming numbers in terms of subscribers and followers so because a lot of youth sometimes follow their parents and then you have youth around his age that could vote as well so they're tuned in too and like i said you guys kai has about 9.5 million subscribers on youtube also another youtube channel with over 6.4 million subscribers and then you have uh, ig then you have twitch then you have uh, kick then you have x so just imagine how many overall followers and subscribers he has it's all it's millions it's multi-millions over 20 million in my opinion i don't know the exact number so this person said i totally agree with him this is the smartest thing he has done <laughs> this person said what would they even say on the stream <laughs> this person says Charlemagne <laughs> gives aiden ross his flowers and says aiden took over cnn headlines after his stream with donald trump well, let's listen to that 
I, I don't even think he was pandering. He was asked a question about a woman, Fannie Willis, who was prosecuting him as well. Mm -hmm. Those have been her most high-profile cases that I've seen. Okay, Jeffrey and Donald, Young Thug and Old Thug. <laughs> and he didn't say anything we all don't feel, which is, you know, Young Thug isn't being treated fairly. Right. I, listen, man, once again, I like to press it. Trump is an unorthodox candidate. He doesn't come from the political world. He's an entertainer, so he understands how to entertain. He understands pop culture. That interview right there owned the headlines yesterday. I was watching Definitely. CNN last night, and from about 6 p.m. to about 10 p.m., when I went to sleep, that interview with Aiden Ross was all over CNN. That's right. And Aiden Ross's age demo was age 13 to 24. 13 mostly, to 24, yep. Yeah, mostly men. Like I said earlier, there's new voters turning 18 every day. Okay, so yeah. to just dismiss that audience and act like that audience doesn't vote, I think that's a grave miscalculation. That is a mistake. Meet people where they are. Yep, and then at the end of that live stream, Aiden Ross gifted uh, Donald Trump a presidential Rolex. Jesus Christ. And also, uh, he gave him a, a wrapped Tesla Cybertruck. Now, is that legal? Probably, because the Supreme Court said, well, it wasn't a bribe. Well, Can they take gifts? Well, con well, Trump seemed excited about it, but they're saying contributions to federal candidates from an individual are limited to $3,300. So they're saying that those, oh, those gifts oh, are valued way more than that. And they believe once Trump finds out uh, that, you know, he's not allowed to take it, he'll be turning down. Yeah, right. Or donating Who's it to charity. Yeah. Donald Trump is going to do the right thing? Okay, but sure. He's probably going to have to in this case. He's probably going to donate Oh, them. please. He's going to donate Y'all still expecting Donald Trump to follow the rules? He ha he's going to knock it off, He's going to donate them. He's probably going to give it to somebody else. Oh, his God, rallies. you naive Americans. <laughs> okay, you guys. So what are your thoughts? Drop some comments in the chat. Like this video. Share this video. <laughs> that was funny what that person said. They're hiring streamers to give votes, allegedly. So, and it's all alleged. And those are comments and opinions on X from in their chat on X, you know. So, but yeah, drop some comments in the chat. Keep it respectful and peaceful. Um, so yeah, I, I highly doubt Kai does this and shocked if he did, but if he did, oh well, uh, and then if he did, trust and believe Kai is going to ask some questions and he's going to do what he want to do pretty much on his stream. It's not going to be, you come over here, politician and control what I do in my space. Kai is a fun kid, a fun person, seems to be good hearted. These are kids. These are kids, you know, so, but Aiden is not a fan of Kamala. <laughs> He's not a fan of Kamala. I'll drop the link in the description section of this post. Yeah. So let me know your thoughts. You guys had like this video, share this video when po politics try to take over streaming. And I say that specifically to Kamala Harris camp trying to take over somebody else stream <laughs> streaming. And, and on the flip side, Aiden Ross actually reached out, reached out to former president donald trump so but yeah this is going to be interesting these polit this is political season they're doing anything for the visits attraction to go viral to stay in the news and the media all of that etc etc but uh yeah shout out again and i've shouted out these young kids before on other videos i've done not on them per se but i just try to encourage you guys my audience supporters subscribers commenters uh, non-subscribers if you are in this media space move around this is how you stay in the know and know what's going on whether you agree or disagree right wrong or indifferent stay in the know with all of this these are top streamers and sometimes some of them may speak about politics and some of them say hey i'm eager to it or don't know this or that or they'll try to figure it out with the chat okay chad let's google this together so it's cute to me it's fun it's funny and then they try to educate themselves while on the stream with their chat so but yeah so we shall see how this go i will i will be shocked if Kai does this, but oh, you never know because he and Aiden are close friends. So let me know your thoughts, you guys, down in the chat. Like this video, share this video, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.